In this course, the definition of metamorphism is made, metamorphism processes, metamorphism rock cycle and metamorphism types are explained. Let's start our lesson now. Metamorphism Definition Metamorphism is a geological process that changes the mineralogical, chemical and textural characteristics of rocks. This process occurs under high pressure and temperature conditions, often deep within the Earth's crust, and can result in the formation of metamorphic rocks such as slate, schist, and marble. The degree and type of metamorphism can vary depending on the conditions and the type of rock that undergoes the process. Metamorphism Process The process of metamorphism involves the alteration of existing rocks due to high pressure, temperature, and or chemical activity. This occurs in the Earth's crust, typically in regions where tectonic plates are colliding or where magma intrusion has occurred. The following are the steps involved in the metamorphism process. Heat transfer, the high temperatures caused by the Earth's internal heat, magma intrusion, or tectonic activity cause an increase in the temperature of the existing rock. Pressure increase, the high pressure is caused by the weight of overlying rock, tectonic forces, or magma intrusion. The increased pressure compacts and rearranges the mineral grains in the rock. Chemical alteration, chemical reactions between the minerals in the rock and the surrounding fluids or fluids generated by the heat transfer can cause the minerals to recrystallize or change into new minerals. Recrystallization, the recrystallization of minerals causes the rock to change in texture and mineral composition, resulting in the formation of a metamorphic rock. The type of metamorphic rock that forms depends on the original rock type, the temperature, pressure, and chemical conditions, and the amount of time the rock was subjected to these conditions. What is metamorphism rock cycle? The rock cycle is a continuous process that describes the transformation of rocks from one type to another through various geological processes, including metamorphism. The metamorphism rock cycle can be described as follows. Start with an existing rock, this can be an igneous, sedimentary, or previously metamorphosed rock. Heat and pressure cause metamorphism, the rock is subjected to high temperatures and pressures, either from tectonic activity, magma intrusion, or burial and uplift. Recrystallization and mineral change, the minerals in the rock recrystallize and change into new minerals, resulting in a metamorphic rock. Erosion and weathering, over time, the metamorphic rock can be weathered and eroded, breaking it down into smaller pieces and releasing minerals and sediments into the environment. Deposition, the eroded materials can be transported and deposited, eventually becoming compacted and cemented to form a sedimentary rock. Burial and compression, the sedimentary rock can be buried and subjected to heat and pressure, causing it to undergo metamorphism and starting the cycle over again. This cycle demonstrates how rocks can change and transform over time through geological processes, including metamorphism, and how one type of rock can eventually become another type of rock. Metamorphism Types Metamorphism can be classified into several types based on the nature and cause of the transformation process. Regional Metamorphism this type of metamorphism occurs over a large area and is caused by the collision of tectonic plates or the intrusion of magma, leading to high temperatures and pressures. Regional metamorphism results in the formation of regional metamorphic rocks such as gneiss, schist, and marble. Contact metamorphism This type of metamorphism occurs when hot magma comes into contact with surrounding rock, causing a localized increase in temperature. Contact metamorphism results in the formation of contact metamorphic rocks such as hornfells and scarn. Hydrothermal metamorphism, this type of metamorphism occurs as a result of the circulation of hot fluids through rocks, leading to changes in mineral composition and texture. Hydrothermal metamorphism results in the formation of hydrothermal metamorphic rocks such as quartzite and siliceous mudstone. Dynamic metamorphism, 
this type of metamorphism occurs due to high-pressure shockwaves caused by events such as meteorite impacts or earthquakes. Dynamic metamorphism results in the formation of dynamically metamorphosed rocks such as pseudotacolite and shatter cones. Thermal metamorphism this type of metamorphism occurs due to the gradual increase in temperature of existing rocks, often due to burial and uplift. Thermal metamorphism results in the formation of thermally metamorphosed rocks such as serpentinite and greenschist. These are some of the main types of metamorphism, and the type of metamorphism that occurs depends on the specific conditions, including temperature, pressure, and chemical conditions, and the type of rock that undergoes the process. For the continuation of the videos, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, open the notifications, like my videos and write a comment under my videos.